What's going on my name is Man. today we are back in some more Portal 2 and last episode we ended off here oh what the hell was that <laughs> came out of the sky uh, we met the boss again from the first Portal game she is back alive god damn it so we have to go and kill her I'm guessing but we ended up down here which is the incinerator which I believe we put her down here I can't remember the first game that much, but um, this is where some of our parts went down here, and now we're stuck down here, I'm guessing trying to get out, and she killed our only friend, the only person that wants us to get out of here, Cliff, he's gone, he might come back alive, he's pretty funny, but, oh, oh, okay, so we're just going to go through this, and, uh, no! Hello? Do I not have my thing? Can I go save you? Oh, I pushed you up there. Oh, no, I've cra oh my god! He exploded. That kind of scared me a little bit. Uh, <laughs> I was not expecting that. I thought I got hold of him, actually. She's trying to help me. Whoa. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Now we have the orange. Orange. I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Here. Right. Let me get did I come from I came from that one. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I had a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life were preserved for analysis. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, We've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. I don't know which way I'm going. Oh, I'm, I might have screwed up. I might have screwed up. Oh, wait. What's this down here? Okay, I was wandering around, wondering what to do. For you. This place really well, thank you. But the important thing is you are back. With me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Sounds a good hobby to me. Maybe she can bring back uh, Cliff. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's better <laughs> I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Right, I'm a pro at puzzle games, you know. I can get through everything. I don't want your stupid cameras that might not work. God damn it. Oh, do I need to use that? Oh, oh I mean, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Oh, bang on, first time. Oh, bro. How do I get over there? I messed up. Not bad. I just I keep thinking you can't walk you on the water. Obviously, it wasn't that yourself, deep. Though. We have a lot of tests to do. So, we're back in the first game then, where we do all the testing. This next test involves discouragement redirection cues. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. There should be. Hmm? So in the first game, she was, uh, I believe we had to keep testing and testing and testing. Did I bring that over there? I don't know. Get in there. We, we just kept testing all the time because that's what the game wanted us to do. And they were looking for the best testers. I believe that's what it was. Not too sure. I haven't played it in a while, 
stop looking at me. Maybe I do that and I can... I don't know. Is that a good idea? I think this is what I do. Where the hell am I? Well done. Here come the test results. You I took a long time. A person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Yeah, that sounds legitimate results there. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just oh, it a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Nice. Where the hell did you come from? So if I get up there and see what it's all about... Um, awesome. Right, so if I do that, let go, and then I'll zap you over there, and the other one needs to go somewhere on here. Oh, perfect. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. She doesn't like being killed, that, that's for sure. <laughs> She's really, really mad. You're navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them, so feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. I mean, I don't think I destroyed this, excuse me. I feel like it was already destroyed, but I think I'll zap you there and... I feel like this will kill me. That's why I'm scared of the water. Oh, I need to go over there. Zapperoo, zapperoo. Smack that. And I'll take that, you know. I feel like it's going to be a very important to get over there. Oh, I see. Oh, God, it's going to get me, isn't it? So if I go... Ugh. Get this... And I believe this thing is going to come round, and then I guess I've got to jump over these. So I need to be here. Then if I zap that, see, I'm a pro at these puzzle games. They can't stop me. I could block this, I think, could I? I probably could just jump over that one. Listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. <laughs> Funny one. She's funny. I can't blame her. She, I did kill her. <laughs> so, I didn't record the first one though, but I probably should have done. I don't know. I played it all, so I didn't really feel like this next test needed to. The science aerial faith plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly oh. positive. They could not. Good luck. Oh. Oh, 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 perfect. Oh, I know what I've got to do. Catapult. Oh, I miss it. Oh, this is the one. I, I, come on. So it needs to bounce like there. Bang. Oh, my God. Perfection. You don't even need to use the teleport for that one. Fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. Soon you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Sounds fun. Um. Oh god, this is going to be hard, isn't it? Uh oh, please make it, please make it, please make it. Oh my god, please make it. Oh my, where are you going? Oh, wow. Oh, I'm screwed now, aren't I? I am done for. Oh wait, I could just zap that there, and now there, I don't even have to go that far. Ha ha ha, there's nothing over it. And if I go up there, would this do something for me? Yes. You didn't have to do what I was going to do. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. 
So sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Oh wait, that's gonna hit there. Could go in. So, so it hit that. All right, but where would that go then? When? Oh no, now that's a cube. Oh, okay. Get it? Hey, hello, friend. But where do you need to go? Oh my god. Okay, so I need to zap one up there. All right. Third time, Lucky. Let's go. Come on, square cube box thing. Get over here. Bounce your way all the way over and land exactly on there. And stay. Thank Remember you very much. I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless. That was a metaphor. Me. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head, which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> Funny one. Do you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I was on that loud. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. She is not happy with me. Did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Where is it? Right, I don't know why you went up and how you did that. Oh wait, I know because this this thing here stops it, and then if I if I if I if I oh, god damn. So if I hit it over here, and then I go bang, and it stayed. Good boy, box. Good boy, cube. Good boy. A lot of sided. Oh. I don't know how this works. I think I bring you over here, place you down, and I can stand on you. I can stand on you, and I can't do anything. Ah, oh, I see a little sign over there. Oh, I see what I have to do. I zap you there, and I can zap that there, and I should be flying all the way over there. First class flight to the next level. Ready, boy? Easy. We're not there yet. All right, we got it. Zap you there, and then zap you, and then kaboom. I'm a pro portal player, Every test you know. chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Try not to. I do want a souvenir though, but... Hello? This next you know? test oh, involves there you emancipation are. grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. So I feel like I'm going to leave this one here. I feel like we're back in Portal 1 again, where she's telling us what to do and testing us to our ability, which probably won't actually end unless we probably have to face her again, which I feel like this is what's going to have to happen. One of us must die. Hopefully we'll carry on until we have a boss battle, which I assume we're going to get one, obviously. Well, I assume we're going to get one. But who knows? So I say thank you for watching. Catch you all in the next video. Goodbye.